Hello everyone and welcome to Vlogmas Day 1. I am so excited to be doing this video. Um, this is the highly requested what I got my kids for Christmas video. I have a lot here. It's going to be a long one. So why don't you go grab a cup of coffee and sit down and join me so we can get through this together. I have an 8 year old and a 2 and a half year old. But I also have five nieces and a nephew to buy for as well. I will try to remember all the prices. If I can't, I will leave everything down below in the description bar for you so you can see how much it was or where I got it from and all that kind of stuff. I do want to say though that everyone's personal situation is different. Everyone has a different budget for Christmas. You know, you might think that this is too much and some people might think that this is too not enough. So this works for our family. We don't go by the four present rule, which is want, need, wear, read, whatever. We don't do that here. Um, we just, I just go through, I start buying in July and I stop when I think that my kids have had enough. Um, I feel that Christmas is a time that I can spoil my kids the most because I don't buy them things through the year unless it's for their birthday. So. Um, we did have a budget and I tried to stick to it. It was around 150 each and then it was up to $30 on family, like nieces and nephews. So that was the budget. I might have gone a bit over, I might have gone a bit under, but all in all I tried to stick around there. So I'm just going to pick up random things because I'm surrounded and let's get in because this intro has been long enough already. So the first one is... Isaac's big present. I don't know if you can see that. This is a Zero X Shot Turbo Advance gun. It comes with. How much does it come with? 40 darts? No, 96 darts in there. It can hold 40 darts in its little bazooka thing there. This thing is massive. Um, $39 from Kmart. I thought this was a steal. It can shoot up to 100 meters. Grab it if you've got boys. Okay, so the next thing is for TJ and it's just this hooded shark towel, beach towel. Um, we are going away in January to where the, there's beaches. It's summer time here in Australia at Christmas time. So he needed a good quality beach towel. This was $10 in Big W and I thought it was such good quality. It's got the little shark hood. He's obsessed with that song Baby Shark. So I thought he would love that. Next one is for Isaac. It's just a beach towel. Yellow and green got a palm tree on it with a little beach. This was $5 in Big W and as I said before they're gonna need beach towels to get them through the summer. Okay next one is for Isaac. It is a kids fishing kit. 130 pieces. Um, it's got everything that they need to fish with on the side and that was $12 from BW so it's got everything that they need plus it comes in a little tackle box I thought that he would absolutely love 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 this um, and he's gonna get so much enjoyment out of it when we go on holidays next one is for TJ and it is this Lego Duplo airport set I know he's gonna have such a good time with this he is obsessed with Lego, anything Lego at the moment, and I got this on special at Big W for $29. So, this was a good steal. It comes with like the little, um, oh, what is it? Little tower, and then it comes to like a little slide so your bags can go down and then go into the plane. I thought that was so, so, so cute. And it comes with two figurines or three? Looks like it comes with three figurines, so he's gonna have such a good time with that. So, yeah. Okay, this one's for my niece. She's nine. She loves slime at the moment. She's obsessed with slime apparently. 
So I, it's this Slime Creations DIY. Mix your own slimy creations. And yeah, so you just mix in the powder with this stuff that they give you. Stir for two minutes and it's slime. Who doesn't love slime in their house? <laughs> this was $20 at Kmart. So she'll love that, I'm sure. Okay, the next one is for my other niece. She is eight. Um, no, she, she was nine actually. So this is like the ultimate colouring experience. It gives you all the pencils in there to go with it. And then it's got um, all these pages that she can colour. And they're very intricate, very tiny, very detailed pages. Um, so I know that she's going to really, really like that. Because um, she really, really likes art at the moment. This was $9 at Target. So a good deal for that one. Okay, this one was fairly interesting. Um, I don't know if you've ever heard of it, but this is called Sand Art or Sand Wizard. And basically what you do is you peel off sections of the picture and then you put the sand into it and it makes like a sand picture. See like the little sun there? So this one's of a rose. I haven't decided who this will go to. It'll go to one of my nieces, but I haven't decided which one. Um, this was $10 at like a market that we went to and I, my kids did one. They really, really liked it. So I thought that this would be so good. It's got like really intricate petals and stuff like that. So they can do all different colors. Comes with all the sand and everything that you need for that. Okay. So the next thing is for TJ and it is a leaf blower. I was so excited when I found this. He, I've got a leaf blower of my own to do the garden and he's obsessed with it. It really works. It blows real air and everything. I was so excited when I found this. He is going to die when he sees it. He absolutely loves anything power tool related. And yeah, and because it blows like real air, I know he's going to get a good kick out of this. This was $12 in Kmart. Next thing's for TJ as well, is this uh, magnetic scribble board. So basically you just like grab the shapes and put it on there. This was $10 I think. Yes, $10 in Big W. So I couldn't go past this. He, we have a friend that's his age and he has one of these and every time we go there he's always asking to play with it. So I thought I'd just get him one of his own and for $10 and it's TJ Masks which is his favourite show in the whole world right now. You can't go wrong. Okay, so the next one is for both the boys, is this Mega Bubble Sword. Um, I originally got this to go on this stocking, but it's just too big. <laughs> it's like, it's huge. It's like half, half of me. It's meant to create these Mega Bubbles. Um, yeah, these are, these are wicked. Um, so basically you just like open the bottle, screw out the sword, pour the solution and dip the sword inside and then just wait it. So, yeah, they'll have such a good time with this. Um, these were $4 each in Kmart, I think. Okay. Next one is for my other niece. She is nine as well. No, this one's ten. So, she's just got this um, adult colouring book as well. This one's got eight gel pens included. Plus, it's got all the little intricate... Um, colouring in for her to do as well. This was $9 in Target 2. I did get them other stuff to go with it. I just haven't found it yet. Okay. This one is for TJ. And we weren't going to buy it, but... I don't know. Tom talked me into it. So <laughs> we ended up buying it. It's this massive sandcastle set. It comes with like a little water table. They can... I don't know if you can see that. Um, maybe if I can find like a tag with a picture on it. No, of course it doesn't. Anyway, it's like a water table that you take down to the beach with you. It comes in this heavy duty bag, so you can just take it with you to go. It's got like a little starfish in there. It's got a trowel, a, sh a shovel, everything that you need for sandcastle building. 
This was $20 in Red Dot and I know he's going to freak out when he sees this. And I like the fact that it had such a heavy duty bag. The thing that I hate when you buy sandcastle toys and stuff and take it to the beach is you don't have anything to take home in. Um, and they usually end up getting broken or lost along the way. Having them in this bag is going to be such a lifesaver. Okay, so I'm just randomly picking here. Because I'm, I don't know if you can see, but I'm kind of making a dent. <laughs> okay, next one is for Isaac. Um, this is to go with the Nerf gun. This is a blow up um, barrier. So it is a stack of tyres that can blow up and he can just hide behind this and shoot at Tom. I'm sure they're going to have fun. I'm pretty sure I'm going to buy Tom a Nerf gun for Christmas this year because he's so obsessed. So, um, yeah, this was, I think, $10 in Kmart. And, yeah, it looks so realistic and he can hide behind there and have so much fun with his friends. So he's going to love that. Okay, the next one is for TJ. It is this medical kit, um, ages 3 to 6. So he will be a bit young when you know, when um, I give it to him at Christmas time, but I don't think he's going to be that young that he won't know what to do with it. Um, if you don't follow me on Instagram, he was sick a few months ago and he had to go to hospital. And ever since then, he's been, like, obsessed with, you know, like the, the little um, stethoscope and the temperature thing. So it's got everything in there that he'll need. It's got a little temperature gauge, a needle, an ear thing, stethoscope, you know, blood pressure cuff, band-aid. All that kind of stuff and that was $24 in BW so I'm sorry about the glare guys I'm trying to trying to show you but yeah it says try me and then you press the button and it goes green or red like to say whether you're sick or not so yeah I think he will really really like that one okay we're slowly getting there next one is for Isaac it is this snorkel set so basically you get flippers a snorkel and um, goggles to go snorkeling as I said we're going to be going away in January and I thought he would be able to use this at the beach um, I can't remember how much this was let's see if I've got it here $25 in Kmart and you get everything plus a little bag to put it in so you really can't go wrong this was for the ages six and up so it'll be the right size for him, hopefully. And yeah, and it's green and orange, which I think are his favourite colours at the moment. So we did well. Next one is for Isaac as well. It's this massive 33 inch, I don't know if you can see me, boogie board. Um, he, he had like, you know, those like little ones that the kids get, but they're just too small for him now. So we decided that it was time to invest in a bigger one because, you know, he's eight now. He needs it to go surfing on. It's just got this wave pattern. I think this is, yep, $10 from Red Dot. What a steal for a boogie board. It doesn't have the ankle thing, but you can always, like, attach, attach one on if you need to. I don't think he'll bother. I mean, he's not going to go out into, like, rough seas and go surfing or anything. So, yeah. The next thing we've got is for my nieces for the colouring packs. I just got them both this 30 pack of gel pens each to go with their um, colouring book pages. Um, I know that they really like gel pens and there's all different colours in there. These were $8 each at Kmart, so such a steal. For those. This is for another niece of mine. She's 13, so she's quite hard to buy for. But what she doesn't have, or I don't think she has, is a wallet. And this was handmade. It's got little otters on there. It is so cute. We got these at the markets down in Fremantle. And this was $30. So, and it's big enough to fit her phone in. It's got heaps of card space, heaps of money space. So I really hope she likes it. Um, yeah, I just couldn't go past the little otters. They're so cute. Okay. We're almost there. Um, this is for TJ and I almost freaked out when I saw this because it is so hard to find Peppa Pig things that aren't going to cost you an arm and a leg. Um, they really are expensive and I scored this whole playground set on eBay for $35 including delivery. 
So it gives gives you Pepper George, Mummy Pig and Daddy Pig plus the whole playground. He is gonna freak out. He loves Peppa Pig. And yeah, I just couldn't pick a better present, I don't think. Okay. This one is also for TJ. It is the Dog Doctor set. So basically it's like a game of operation, but it's with the dog. Um, I know they've got little pieces in it, and I know people are going to kind of be worried. Please don't worry. He does not... He's not a kid that eats things. Um, he's never been a kid to put things in his mouth. And obviously he's going to be supervised. But I just couldn't go past it. It's like a little dog. And you have to get like the bones out. And all that kind of stuff. So I thought he would really like this. This was only $10 in Kmart. Okay. This one is uh, TJ as well. And it is a pack of three trucks. The cat trucks that you get. Um, and a little hard hat. <laughs> How cute. Um, yeah, I saw this in Big W. And I really couldn't go past it. He doesn't have any trucks that he can play with in the sand at the beach. And I really thought these were good. They're sturdy. They're not going to break easy, they're not flimsy, and they're small enough to take in the car and take to the beach and just have fun with. And they're, they're okay to get sand in because they're plastic. So, yeah, I can't remember how much this was. Uh, $29 in Big W for three trucks and a hat. And you really just can't go past this. This is really good quality um, dump trucks. There you go. Almost there. This one, I know if you've got boys, you'll be excited to see that. This one. This is called Gooey Louie. <laughs> Basically, it's a game where you pick the boogies out and you've got to you've got to spin the thing and it tells you how many boogies to pick. If you pick too many boogies, his brain pops out. Yes. <laughs> Aren't boys fun? Um I saw this and I just couldn't go past it. It's for ages two and up, so TJ can play. Um, it's for two plus players as well, so if he's got his friends over, he can have four people playing it. And what, what can I say? Like, it was a bargain. It was $29 in Big W. Who can say no to that? You get free boogies and all. Okay. <laughs> Almost there. This is the last present for Isaac. It is this Harry Potter figurine from Sanity. He was $19. Um, Sanity is a DVD shop over here in Australia. I don't know if you guys have anything like that. But yeah. He saw this months ago and asked me for it. I don't even know if he does anything. $20 and he just doesn't even do anything. But whatever. I think these are all the rage now. These little pop things. So, yeah, I'm sure he'll be happy to have that one. This one's for my youngest niece. She's five... Four or five? She's got um, this Barbie set. I wish I had something like this when I was her age. It is a pizza-making Barbie set with Play-Doh. So you get the Play-Doh down there, and then you make the pizza with it through the pizza maker. How cool is that? It goes through the conveyor belt comes through the pizza machine and comes out like goes through the cheese thing so it like drops all the cheese on it uh, where are we uh, yeah it goes through there and then goes through the fire and then comes out of the register <laughs> I wish I had something this cool when I was a kid pretty sure this was $29 in Target oh the last thing it's the last one this one is for TJ and when he saw me buy this, I really thought, I thought, oh yeah, because he's so little, he's two, he's not going to remember me buying this. He remembers me buying this because all he asks is for his choo-choo. Um, this is a Take and Play Rory, Rory Thomas and Friends Dino Run. Um, so it folds over, you can take it with you wherever you go. And I thought this would be such a good idea for him because when we go travelling, we can just fold it up and take it. It makes sounds. So... This was actually on sale for $35 down from, where is it, 70 
so I couldn't say no. <laughs> I was like, that's coming home with me. <laughs> TJ absolutely loves Thomas. It comes with a train. Pretty sure it comes with one train. Pretty sure it does. Yes, includes Thomas. Um, I did buy him another train to go in his stocking, but that will be in another video. So yeah, that is it. That is absolutely everything that I got my kids for Christmas this year. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to tune in tomorrow. Tomorrow will be an adult gift guide video, what I got for the adults. And then the day after that, I'm pretty sure I'm doing the what's in my kids stocking video. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye guys.